Hi, this is Don McAllister and welcome to another Tip of the Week video. I had a great suggestion for this week's topic from Steve Smith from the US, and Steve suggested covering some quick tips on using voice dictation on the Mac and iOS. So firstly, let's take a look at how you can use the built-in dictation features of OS X El Capitan. Now on the Mac, wherever you can type text, you can use dictation to enter that text, whether it be documents or forms, uh, basically any application, you can use dictation. You do need to configure it first, you need to switch it on. Also, if you want to use dictation offline, you need to uh, download some data as well. But if we go to System Preferences, and then within System Preferences, Dictation and Speech, and here we go. So it's currently off. If I switch it on, uh, you can use enhanced dictation. This allows you to uh, go offline and use dictation and have continuous dictation as well. I'm going to go ahead and select that. So it's going to take a minute or two to download. So we'll come back once that's completed. So that download has completed. Uh, just need to do a little bit of configuration. You need to select the microphone you're going to be using. Now there is an automatic setting, so it's picking up my Onyx Blackjack, which is my USB mic that I'm speaking into, but you can use the internal mic or any other mics you have connected to your Mac. Uh, the language, English, United Kingdom, and then the shortcut. So I'm going to press the function key on the keyboard twice to invoke dictation, but you can select any of these others or you can customize as well. So let's leave it as pressing the function key twice, pop that down out of the way. I've actually got a text edit document here. So to start dictation, I double tap the function key. My name is Don McAllister, full stop, new paragraph. This is some test dictation using OS 10. Full stop, new paragraph. As you can see, comma, it works exceedingly well. Exclamation point. And then we'll just say done. And that's using dictation on the Mac. Let's have a look at dictation on iOS. So across on the iPad, this also works on the iPhone as well. Uh, there's no configuration to do. You have a single microphone attached to your iPad and everything is set up, ready to go. But the way you invoke dictation is through the keyboard. So for instance, if I want to go into the Notes app, I've got a new note created here. If I want to dictate some text into my note rather than type, I just tap on the little button down at the bottom, the one that looks like a microphone, and away we go. So let's give this a try. My name is Don McAllister. Full stop, new paragraph. This is some test dictation using iOS. Full stop, new paragraph. As you can see, this also works exceptionally well. Exclamation point. And there you have it, dictation on iOS. If you want to learn more about using your Apple devices, there are over 700 full video tutorials available to Screencast Online members, covering all aspects of the Mac, iPhone, iPad, Apple Watch, and even the Apple TV. Now, all full members receive a new Apple-related video tutorial each and every week, as well as a free subscription to the Screencast Online monthly magazine, packed with videos and articles on getting the most out of your Apple devices. Now, you can get your free 14-day trial membership over at screencastsonline.com, or check out some of the free content over on the SEO Showcase app on the iPad, iPhone, and Apple TV. That's it for this week. I'll be back next week with another tip, so I'll speak to you then.